Boys and girls, today let's talk about Publisher Rocket. I'm going to explain what is this, how to use it, and why you should get it. So let's get to rock and rolling, baby. Hi there, this is Journal X, and welcome to another great, amazing, and explosive video where I'm going to talk about what is Publisher Rocket, how you can use it, and why should you get it. For your Kindle publishing business. Anyway, make sure to go right below, click on that thumbs up, why not, and also subscribe to my YouTube channel so you can receive my weekly video updates where I share with you plenty of videos related to Kindle publishing and several ways for you to make money online. Let's talk about Publisher Rocket. It's going to be explosive today. This is a software that used to be called KDP Rocket, but I guess they can't use KDP because it probably has copyrights and for that reason now it's called Publisher Rocket yeah, I prefer KDP Rocket and sometimes I may mistake and just call it KDP Rocket well this is basically a software that you can install on your computer and it is very useful a software that you can install and I'm going to show to you the several features that are over here but the main reason let's just kind of remove this idea the main reason why i use uh, publisher rocket i mean is because amazon advertisement okay that is the main reason i would say that 90 percent of the reason i use this or even more is just because amazon advertisement and i mean i always suggest for you to use amazon advertisement if you are serious about making more money with your books each time that you publish your book you can do a lot more money just by promoting it inside of Amazon by using their service. So there's no reason for you to not use Amazon advertising. But there is one problem when it comes to this. I don't I'm not sure if you already had it campaigns or not, but one of the, the main problems that you have is each time that you set a new campaign, you can have or you can add up to 1000 keywords into each campaign and I highly suggest for you to optimize this to the maximum number and the reason for this is let's say that you set a, a new campaign okay and you just added five keywords to your campaign so you had it for example yoga yoga for beginners and other actually there's several or yoga for beginners and three other keywords and your campaign just has five keywords or you could call it book titles whatever you want to call it doesn't matter but I guess you get the idea now what happens is your book will get promoted basically to this five keywords to this five different keywords so what happens is your book will appear whenever someone searches for yoga for beginners they search for yoga for beginners inside of Amazon and they are able to find your book being sponsored inside of Amazon and they purchase your book but the fact is if you're doing campaigns why not immediately have the maximum number of keywords which is 1000 keywords because this just increases the visibility of your books a lot more this means instead of someone just finding your your book for five keywords you are able to find your book for 1000 keywords or search terms book titles whatever okay so it just increases your your book visibility a lot more and by this also the sales that your book does okay so if you are using amazon advertisement you always want to optimize your campaigns for the maximum number of keywords now the problem comes with the maximum number of keywords because finding 1000 keywords mally is the most boring piece of shit ever i did this initially when i first uh, did my new campaigns when i started using amazon advertisement and it was just ridiculously boring and i couldn't stand it and after a few hours i was just going nuts okay I was going so nuts that eventually I just said no I gotta get publisher rocket I cannot do this anymore because 
doing this process manually it consists on you searching uh, uh, for keywords in several books going through the categories page it's it's a whole ah, it takes you hours 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 now the great thing about using publisher rocket is basically you can get hundreds of keywords in just a click of a button which i'm going to show to you it's quick easy simple and the great thing about publisher rocket is once you get it deal done you don't have monthly fees there's no monthly fees it's great okay so this is one of the softwares that i can't say that i highly suggest for you to get it and if you are going to use amazon advertisement there's no way around it you eventually will you may start doing it finding those keyword keywords manually but eventually all all roads leads to kind of publisher rocket all roads leads to publisher rocket and you will see it so there's several features over here and the main one is really this one but i'm going to show to you this one and this one and all of them just so you can get the the complete idea of what comes with publisher rocket this first feature is pretty decent and often or sometimes i use it and this allows you to get some some keyword ideas for your books let's say that you have a, a broad keyword like yoga or yeah yoga let's try yoga you have a broad keyword like yoga and yeah yoga although it's it's extremely profitable it's also very competitive and for you to have a book ranking in the front page of results where you are able to make sales with your book is extremely hard because there's so much competition from authors who have who have an audience of people just kind of going crazy with their books and i mean if you're a publisher that's not an ideal thing so what sometimes you may do is go for what we call a longer tail keyword or in other words a keyword that has have more words and also as a result they are more less competitive and sometimes also less profitable but it's just easier for you to make money with those those keywords instead of a broad keyword and over here you can get a bunch of different ideas as you may see okay there's a lot of keyword ideas and you can also click analyze and for some reason today this is taking a few seconds but it often it usually is quick to get this information over here I don't pay much attention to this information I just wanted to show to you but it's taking a few seconds today okay as you can see we have over here the all of this information the number of competitors average monthly sales or earnings I don't pay much attention to this nor do I pay much attention to Google searches I sometimes like to look to the estimate Amazon searches per month this means the number of people that are going to Amazon to the small search box appearing in Amazon and they are typing in yoga book okay it's basically that this is the number of searches and the competitive score which is something that I don't pay much attention the main reason I use this keyword search is just to get some other ideas of keywords for my books and then I go to those keywords and based on the the criteria that I have I follow a criteria to see if those keywords are profitable or not and worth me publishing books under those keywords but yeah you can see the competition over here. it's not a huge thing you can even click over here and this goes to the second tab as you can see this list gives you the listing of all of the books under yoga books so if you search inside of Amazon for yoga book this would be the the books that would appear in this li in that listing I mean or the search results and this can this gives you an idea if a keyword is way too competitive or not you can see this information over here uh, the age of the book I guess this is in days I'm not sure probably it's in days let me see yeah this is in days I don't often use this feature but it's a useful feature because as I already said I did this I just go to the the keywords and I analyze this information 
and also this is paid in Kindle store it's actually doing pretty well 10,000 paid in Kindle store is pretty good if it's well optimized for yoga book as you can see it's not it doesn't have yoga book appearing on the title uh, yoga in the search term I guess this is description uh, sales daily sales and also monthly sales okay this gives you an idea these are all estimates it doesn't mean this book is doing this money per day may be doing may not be doing but it's do I mean a book that has uh, 10,000 paid in Kindle store yeah I would say it's nearly doing this amount of money because I already have books uh, with this ranking or both this ranking and they were doing nearly this per month okay so you can see over here and based on this information you can easily see whether or not a keyword is uh, too competitive category search is another thing that you can use to uh, search for categories for your books and and basically publish your your book under categories that are profitable because people can also go to categories inside of amazon and find your book so this is something that you can also use and you can get um, all of the subcategories appearing and so on see their profitability sales all of this information here but let's go to the main feature this is the main feature is it's this last one over here okay you can go to home and click over here oh, also on the top this is the main feature this is the reason why I use uh, publisher rocket so let's say that I want to make a campaign for a new yoga book that I have I could go over here and just go yoga and click on this button and just in a few seconds I have a bunch of keywords that I can use for my campaign as you can see easily I get a bunch of keywords and I don't need to do this process Mali I have over here probably a few a few hundreds of keywords that I can use because I also use the author names for my, have as my keywords for my campaigns so I also use the author names and you get a lot of new keywords and then I just export to my computer and once I export I basically join all of the keywords that I have gathered using Publisher Rocket and I put over here until I fill it with 1000 keywords. Let's just do another one. Let's say yoga for big yoga. Uh, let's try another thing. Um, spirituality. Okay. And it just takes a few seconds until it loads and I get a bunch of new keywords which I could use also for my campaign because it's kind of related to yoga okay and also as you can see you have an, another option such as book and basically gets um, it's kind of similar but it's not the same sometimes it gives you different keywords compared to ebook and I like to use both both options okay to get some extra keywords that would not find otherwise in ebooks. And yeah, that is basically the main reason why I use this. I mean, just in a in a few minutes, let's say in ten minutes or even less, I get the necessary keywords that I need for each campaign. And this is something that if I did Mali, it would take hours. It would take hours for me to get all of these keywords. So this is the main feature, Publisher Rocket. This is Publisher Rocket. And as I already said, if you get Publisher Rocket, it's a one-time deal. You don't need to worry about anything else. There is no monthly fees, nothing like that. And also the, the owner of Publisher Rocket, he, he or his company are constantly updating their software with uh, new things. Okay. And if you get Publisher Rocket from me, just send an email to jordan at jordanalexo.com i'm going to leave all of this information right below on the description from this video i will leave the link so you can get publisher rocket and also my email address 
just send an email to Jordan at Jordan Alexo so I can send to you my free bonus pack. In this free bonus pack, it basically will help your life a lot more when it comes to publishing inside of Kindle. And you will get several templates such as for the your author template so you can have an author page that looks professional and that will help you sell more books instead of Amazon, a book information page template, topic research and brainstorming sheets so you can more easily find profitable keywords for your books, Kindle formatting guide and templates, and book cover images and templates. So you will get all of these templates directly sent to your email inbox. Just send me a message once you get Publisher Rocket using the link right below on the description from this video. And if you have any question related to Publisher Rocket, leave it on the comment section right below. Also make sure to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. That is all for now. Stay there, stay tuned with Jordan Alexo and bye.